feeling a little better. I didn't want to complain and wear y'all. I think I went through the virus thing and uh, still dizzy, hard to stand up. And uh, I'm uh, back in motion a little bit. I'm not 100%, but I'm back. And sorry about not posting a video. I just wasn't up to it and I wasn't into crying and and um, pissing and moaning, carrying on. But um, look what I did do one day though. My buddy Randy, he, he gave me a, oh Jesus, he gave me a cooker. It's right over here. And a bunch of um, lead weights. And uh, guess what? I made some weights for the back of the car. Now I can put them where I want. This car is going to handle better and better as I learn all the tricks. And uh, it took me two days to wash and vacuum the car out and wash it, check the fluid, check this, check that, and make sure the bugs didn't get in there over the duration from last December. I got kind of disgusted because they wrecked me. Oh, and I fixed the fender this morning. I'm really going today. <clears throat> um, straightened the fender out, got it so the hood will fit. I don't have no springs on the hood. I'm trying to, I'm going to make an aluminum hood that I could pick off, make it a lot easier and lighten up the front because I got them weights to put in the back. And now I can put the weight where it's supposed to be. Get the stagger right, get the spring rates right, get some shocks. God, I, I just need so much money to do this. It's unbelievable. I got to set up the thing, my Zell account. So anybody that wants to help sponsor my car or uh, throw a little something in to help me out, I'm going to freehand personally myself, write their name on the car. Thank you. And put their names on the car as a sponsor. And then when we go out there and start winning races, you can go on YouTube and show everybody. Say, look at this. This guy, when he first started on YouTube, we thought he was a whack job or whatever. And uh, it really old, 76, and he got an old junkie. It ain't what you got. It is what you got, but it's how you use it also. You got to have the combination of both. I watched a thing on TV this morning about um, Corey, Le Corey LeJoy. He said... The only difference between him and Kyle Larson and 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 um, and, and the, all the other guys in NASCAR running up top is the equipment. He said the top four or five cars you could switch most of the drivers in NASCAR and take them and put them in them cars and they'll run first, second, third, and fourth. And you know what? I believe him. He's right. It's all about money. And I can see it here. Look. Now, who else you know running the steel? stock body car you know all steel i can't afford to go out and buy panels and this and that and everything else i want to put the money in the motor and, and springs and shocks now i need springs I, I i'm going to take the springs out of this one i'm cutting up and i'm going to rate them and see if they're good enough to put in the front of here if they're the right size and i got springs for free as soon as i rate them if they're what i want to put in this car close to them i put them in i can buy a set of pre-made a uh, set um, at Speedway Motors. I think they're like 400 bucks, 450 for a set of shocks that are borderline run, um, average run of what you put on shocks for dirt track. You tell them what size track and what it is. And they'll send you a set of shocks and uh, something to start with. And if it doesn't handle quite right or something like this, you get a different shock for the right rear, one for the left rear, blah, blah, blah. You know, all that. And you do it with the spring rates. You get, once you get the shock package and the spring package together, it's all about driving. And then tires. You prep the tires. You sipe them and groove them and, and whatever you got to do to prep them. Uh, grind them off a little bit, soften the rubber up. And it, it makes a world of difference. The people that don't do it, don't win. You got to have everything. It is not just the driver. It's not just the car. It's a combination of everything. Everything has to be right. You miss the setup on the air pressure by three or four pounds and you're out to lunch. You get it just right and you pass people, you just wave at them as you go by. That's the name of the game. <clears throat> That's the way it is. 
anyway, I'm going to start making my videos again. Sorry for the break. I hope you didn't think I dropped off the face of the earth. I, I just wasn't feeling good at all. And uh, I fixed my fender. I'm going to start making a hood tomorrow. I'll video part of that. And I'm going to start getting thing ready to pour my garage in the back so I have more room for another car. <clears throat> and uh, I'm going to start building one from the ground up. And I'm going to video the whole thing for people that want to try to do it with me anyway um, I think that's it and uh, I want to make a video I'm going to make a video guilty 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 about people that <laughs> it is a it's kind of a whole video in itself about people that eat hamburger and put hamburgers on their kitchen table so they can buy gas for their race car and when you get to the track you ask if anybody's got any race gas left over because you don't have enough gas to get home instead of eating steak you eat hamburger and you put gas in your race car and you 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 could not believe how many people right in between the people that are well well to do and and uh, people that got sponsors and it makes a world of difference but if it wasn't for those people and people like me you wouldn't have a race what are you going to do? Go watch top three cars with mega money in them, go around in circles, and uh, the same person wins every week, one or two or three cars. They do it now, but they got to come through a whole pack of cars if they start in the back. So anyway, that's part of the game, and I'm going to be in the pack, and they're going to have to try to pass me. Uh -uh. Pretty soon, it ain't going to happen. Nope, I'm going to be right up there with them. Okay. Uh, let me go. I hope I got this right. This is it's the fourth time I shot this, this, uh, this uh, channel, mo this movie, or whatever content. Well, I don't know what they call it, TV uh, language. But um, anyway, uh, let me go. I'm, I'm hungry. I'm going to go and get a sandwich. Uh, thank you. Thank you for listening. Push the button. Push the like. Push the subscribe button, please. Unless you push the subscribe already. And you're already going to get my video. Sorry about the lull in between. I'm still not 100%. I'm going to go in and get a sandwich lay down for an hour. And I'm going to come out. I'll probably turn the video on again. See if I get to catch something to send you. Thank you. Thank you for your time.